Uh, Kane, is it, is it always nice to get the, the first game of the season under the belt, albeit not the result you wanted? Um, yeah, like you said, we're disappointed with the result, obviously. You work for six weeks for the first game of the season and um, a lot of emphasis goes into what you want to do for, throughout the season and how you're going to approach games. So, yeah, it's always exciting to finally get to that first game earlier than I've ever played it before. But, um, yeah, there was excitement, but like you say, we're disappointed with, with the result and um, we'll do get a better one this weekend. It is a new team by and large. I mean, I think there were five debuts in the starting eleven mm. on Saturday. So, is it naturally going to going to take time to bed in, or is, yeah. is that too, too much of a simple excuse? Um, it's going to take time to bed in, but I think we we're all good players. Do you know what I mean? So we have to play better than what we played on Saturday. I don't think you can use that excuse for for Saturday. But yes, it will take. Um, there, there will be games where. Um, Things maybe don't go to plan the way the way, the way that it does because obviously there's a lot of fresh faces, a lot of people trying to uh, learn new roles, learn new players, stuff like that. So yeah, things will take time, but with that, I think you still have to have a level of performance that was um, somewhat a little bit better than than we we showed at times on Saturday. And on that note, particularly for you as a striker, I mean, you presumably a a, a learning. Or well, the wingers maybe are learning from you, and the midfielders are learning what your what, the way you like the ball, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Can you only sort of get that in a, in a game atmosphere versus training? Um, no, no, you can learn it in training. Um, you can definitely learn it in training. That's the, the whole point in training, really, isn't it? Do you know what I mean to, to to learn these things and, and iron certain things out as a team? So, yeah, we're still we're still early. There's still a lot of fresh faces, young faces, people who um, still learning little known house of the game and, and that will come over time but hopefully with that we um, the older lads like myself Cogs um, JT when he comes into the team Tom Davis Leo O'Connor um, I say Leo O'Connor but <laughs> he's probably one of the most experienced in the team in a minute to, to get to get round people and um, show them away if, if that makes sense and just for you personally how much of an honour was it to, to have the armband on Saturday yeah yeah big honour um the oldest one in the squad now, so <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, big honour. Um, I was at captain Burton a few times last season. Um, it, it's a responsibility I quite enjoyed, to be honest, and um, massive club to, to, to be captain. So hopefully, I can, um, hopefully, I can kind of do everyone proud and, and, and lead by example and show that I'm, I can be a good leader. And how does it work captaining when you're a striker? Because th there will be some that say captains are, are very often in defence and yeah. even in goal. Um, how does it work? I don't know. That's a good question. Um, <laughs> I, I don't know. I, I just I'm, I'm not really thinking too much of it. Really, I just try and train well every day. Do do the right things. Try and try and almost just just lead by example a little bit. Maybe it's um, well, I don't really know. Just try and just just show a good attitude to, to everyone else and try and try, try and lead if the, the best way that as a striker I, I can I, I'm, I'm aware that there'll be a lot of times in the game that maybe when we're defending and they've got the ball you might not be involved as much or, or, or whatever but um, I don't know just try and be a good teammate and try and help people out as much as possible and you play one of your former teams at the weekend yeah. what, what did, what's that like when you go and play a four is it a little bit different to just playing at any other side mm. Well, I only went to uh, well. I've only been there once before, and went back, and that was in Notts County. So that was a that was a bit of a boo fest, to be honest. But um, it's been about five years since then, so hopefully, <laughs> hopefully they've calmed down a little bit. But listen, I'm looking forward to the game. Um, they'll be a good team. I know a lot of the lads, I know the manager, the management staff, and people behind the scenes there. So I'm looking forward to going back and and seeing old faces. And um, but I still want to go there and win. Can that work though if you've got fans giving you a bit of stick? No, it, just, it doesn't really matter to me to be honest. I mean, home fans, away fans, if it's not the only way, they're all going to give you stick, so it doesn't matter. It's just, you've got to play your own game. Uh, and the, the away form last season clearly was, was the Achilles heel, it was the difference between you perhaps getting the playoffs and not. So yeah. is that big on, on the yeah. agenda this season to, yeah, to no, write that? No, 100%. It's something that become a little bit embarrassing to be honest towards the end of last season so um, 
yeah, it's something that we definitely need to get better better at. We need to go to places and um, put on better performances and, and definitely come away from a lot more places with more positive results than we did last year because one or two different results last year and, and we should have had more than that but, but even just one or two would have got us into a position to go up so um, it's fine margins when you're going away from home and one goal to your tally so far already have you got a target in mind no no not at all um, I have done in previous seasons I've always said if you get to 15 plus you've had a good season but to be honest with you I just if I score goals brilliant if I don't then I just want to play as well for the team and hopefully provide what I can provide for the team, whether that's with goals or assists and just leading by example up front and, and hopefully pulling people through with me. So if I score goals, brilliant. If I don't, then it's what it is, as long as I'm putting in good performances for the team. And, and just something you alluded to earlier, you, you're 31, hope you don't mind me saying that. 30. 30, I apologise. Yeah. I'll say that again. Cheeky. <laughs> <laughs> just something you alluded, just something you alluded to earlier. You're 30. The interviewer says, um, but I, I get the impression from you that there's a real sort of inner belief and a, 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 a real confidence from you at the moment. From myself or the team? Yeah, uh, for yourself. Um, yeah, listen, I've, it's. Um, I'm going to be honest. It's 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 something that over a year over the years, I think when you especially in a forward position, you. you Sometimes you'll, you'll see strikers in and out of confidence. Some things don't go for them, whatever. But it, it, I don't know how it might sound. I, I don't know how it sounds, but I'm at a stage now. Where I'm just not bothered. Like I'm just going to go out and play. And if it if it works, it works. If it doesn't, it doesn't. I know I know my strengths. And I've got a manager who believes in me. I've got teammates who I know believe in me. Coaching staff who believe in me. They've they've put their faith in me last season when things weren't going well. Played me when things did go well. Got around my me and said, well done. So. Why would I? Why would I go out and and not have full confidence in my, in my own ability when the feeling that I get is everyone else believes in me? So why would I doubt myself when I know and I, I'm proven at this level that I can play well and score goals and and provide for a team? So um, I don't know. It might sound cocky or big-headed. I, I I don't mean it to come across that way, but I have confidence that I can do. I can definitely do a job and provide for the team.